In today's video, I will be reviewing the full Disney Nuimo Summer Fashion Collection number 3 and bringing you the latest Nuimo's news. Jarvis and welcome to episode 2 and my first detailed collection review. Today I will be reviewing the summer fashion collection number 3. I ordered all 7 of the outfits from Shop Disney UK with two doubles so Chip and Dale can wear the same outfits. Let's start with the Hawaiian shirt and short set that comes with the towel. It's described as a coordinating shirt and shorts that feature an all-over tropical plant print. The sandals are described as contrasting, which orange does contrast, um, with a strap and shiny footbed. They're quite well made. The towel is woven with stripes. It's a little bit smaller than I was hoping for. Another bit closer view of the shirt. It has embroidered detail, which shows the um, button detail. It has the part of the collar sewn down. And this pattern matches um, many um, people clothes, um, so you could dress your whole family to match your new emo. The shorts have an elasticated waist. And they're nice and easy to put on. And here we have Eeyore, who's wearing the outfit. And here's that towel. Not a beach towel, no. <laughs> You're really not going to be able to lie on that. Yes, you can carry it over your arm. On to the striped shirt with cap and sneakers. This one is described as a shirt featuring yarn, dye stripes, embroidered buttons on front, denim pants and denim cap. Sneakers with print design. I really do like these sneakers. They do the um, uh, Velcro fastening on the back. And the colour design looks really good. The denim pants, or trousers as we would call them in the UK, have embroidered detail. And have a Velcro at the back. And the striped shirt. Embroidered detail on the front with the buttons and Velcro fastening on the back of it. This one has the collar sewn down at the back to help it lie flatter. And this cap, made of denim, and at the back there is a um, bit of elastic, which helps keep the hat on the head. And I've teamed this up on Tigger. Now bless poor Tigger, his head looks a little bit too small for the cap on Winnie the Pooh and <laughs> on Kermit. I'd probably say the best fit is on Stitch, which probably means it'd be the best fit also on Angel. And next we have the yellow gingham dress with sun hat and straw bag. This one's described as 
a gingham dress features eyelet trim with scalloped edge hem and satin shoulder straps and straw hat with wide brim. Now the straw bag is embroidered with the floral design and circle handle. Really like this bag. You could actually put something in it. And here it is compared with one of the previous releases bags and look, there's no comparison. This really is a nice bag. And the dress, nice details, thin satin straps with Velcro opening at the back. It's so easy to put on, really quick and easy outfit to put on. Also really like the coordinating hat that goes with the uh, bag. Tried the outfit on um, Piglet first. Looks a little bit big on Piglet, but mind you, nearly everything looks a bit big on Piglet. So I tried it on Angel and much better fit and goes really pretty on her. Overall, really like this outfit. And now for the rash guard with shorts and strap sandals. I had to Google what a rash guard was, but it's basically a swimsuit that protects you while you're swimming. The sandals, now that was a bit of fun with these. Um, I will explain a little bit more later, um, but uh, yeah, I, I decided after I had a bit of fun trying to put them on that I like them. I do find it quite amusing how you have a pair of sandals and they're very different in shape from one another. Shorts, I can't say I'm particularly happy with the elastic. Um, you can see it at the top. Um, but, uh, yeah, it is what it is, I suppose. And the rash guard. Again, it's in that um, nice tropical plant print with a pink background, a Velcro at the back. You put the legs through there. And there it is so that you can see it clearly on stitch. And here he is with the shorts on. Here is the bit of fun that I had with uh, <laughs> putting those sandals on. First of all, I tried poking them through and then I realised you had to go in through the top part. Um, so there, there you go, through those straps there, poke it through there and pull it back. Yeah, they fit really nice and they're not going to fall off. Um, they're probably one of the best um, sandal designs. Yeah. You can't, you can't see the elastic quite as bad as I thought you would. Now here is the olive overalls with pink visor. Now in the UK we would call these dungarees and not overalls. Overalls to us cover all of the body, as in the arms as well as the legs. Um, but uh, yeah, dungarees. Um, they have Velcro fastener and the shoulder straps over on the front they have a nice wide leg um, again which makes it nice and easy to put these on the pink um, polo shirt is what I believe that they call this um, a short sleeves and a back velcro opening and I really like the material of this, kind of 
shiny, soft material. They look nice teamed up with uh, a pair of denim jeans. And that velour visor with the reflective bill, which is see-through. Do you like this? It's a nice little addition. And here we have, I bought two of these and um, there they are on Chippendale. Next we have the ruffled shirt with mini skirt and leopard print sandal set. The sandals the, with the crossover strap um, came with a little bit of cotton holding the cross in place. Um, I decided to leave that there. Holds it nice and in the middle. And again, very slightly different um, shapes. Which is what I've come to expect from the shoes, to be honest, the sandals and the shoes. The mini skirt has a really nice embroidered detail uh, for the pockets and uh, pockets on the front and the back and as with all these things a nice velcro um, fastening at the back and the ruffled short sleeves and hemmed shirt has a nice um, all over floral print, back velcro, fastening. These arms aren't elasticated. I'll cut that off later. Nice details. And here it is on Piglet. Maybe the skirt's a little bit long. But the top fits really nicely. So, on to the last of our outfits, which is the pastel striped dress with the strap sandals. The description on the Shop Disney UK website states um, that this set includes a handbag too. This isn't the first time an accessory has been mentioned in the description but has been removed from the actual item on sale. Now these sandals feature three iridescent crossover straps and I had a little bit of fun trying to work out how these guys went on. The dress um, is yarn dye stripes and has puff sleeves with elastic cuffs. The crossover bodice at the front and Velcro fastening at the back. The side tie at the waist doesn't undo, it's fixed. Now here we are, showing how those shoes, not quite sure how to put them on, decided to go with one of the straps at the back. I think these ones are going to be ones that are going to fall off. Um, all of the outfits in the collection, all seven of them, are all priced exactly the same, which is £11.95 in the UK, $12.99 in the US, and €15.90 in Europe. And now for the Nuimo's news. Nuimo's collectors were disappointed on May 3rd when they discovered the chair and umbrella accessories weren't available in the US or Europe. 
the artwork was on the US Shop Disney site, had them edited out. Later in the day, both on the Disney New Emo's Instagram and Facebook pages, they posted a picture launching the new release. It said, Hot Summer Styles are here. Up your fashion game this summer with the new summer fashion collection. Oh, one more thing it said. Disney New Emo summer props coming soon. So, looks like their arrival has just been delayed. The teaser for the June release is Explore Under the Stars. Great outdoor styles are calling. We can see a new red zip top on Minnie and just make out a tent in the background. This is coming on June 7th. We'll keep you posted with any more news. If you enjoyed my video, please hit the like button and comment below to let me know what you'd like to see in my future videos. And of course, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss my next episode. Thanks for watching!